supplements? That's today's question on Healthy Hot Air. I'm Camden Smith here with you. If we took every single vitamin and supplement that is promoted out there, I swear we would just open up this bottle, chug a bunch of pills, never eat any fruits and vegetables, and say, to heck with it, right? So let's cut through the baloney. Do you need a supplement of fish oil? Yes, if you have coronary heart disease, yes, if you have risk factors like me with diabetes, a 40% increase risk in coronary heart disease, absolutely. Why am I taking a supplement? I don't like fish, I'll be honest with you, don't like much fish. I would have to eat three and a half ounces of fish a day to get one gram of EPA and DHA, the important omega-3 fatty acids in my diet. Not gonna happen with this chick. So I take a supplement. I like the Neutral Omega-3 fish oil because you don't burp it up all day long because there's nothing more disgusting and there are some out there that will happen, just FYI. So I like this. Now, if you do not have coronary heart disease, the American Heart Association says you only need to eat seven ounces of fish a week. That's nothing. That's three and a half ounces twice a week or seven ounces in one sitting. But you need to have that minimum amount. Why do we need omega-3 fatty acids? Quick rundown, here's what it does. Reduces inflammation, reduces arthritis and the symptoms thereof. It also helps fight off dementia, Alzheimer's, and many other chronic diseases. Why? Because it reduces inflammation and it also helps with us being able to produce new cells in the body, which is important for keeping us younger and healthier. So, take a supplement if you need one gram a day, but otherwise, just enrich your diet in some fish, call it a day, and don't believe all the hype that you need to take a supplement for every single thing out there. Hopefully we helped you cut through some of the baloney and we will see you next time.